How's it going, everybody? This is Grindhouse21 with my trusty wiener dog, Leia. And today, we are playing Destroy All Humans, Path of the Furon. I do not believe I've played this game. I've owned it for a while, but I haven't, I haven't played it. But now that the new one is coming out, or the uh, remake is coming out of the first uh, Destroy All Humans, I thought I'd, you know, plug this in and give it a go. So, here we go. Obviously. Loading screens. Like it already. The time is nearly at hand. A great wrong will be righted. An ancient prophecy fulfilled. And a hero of legend will arise. Bigfoot. The Loch Ness Monster. Alien invaders. Do they exist? I'm Veronica Stone. And for 42 of the next 60 Veronica minutes, Corningstone. we'll be in quest for aliens. Bigfoot. These humans will believe anything. Not anything, Crypto. But after two turbulent decades, many of them are finally ready to believe in us. That makes them more dangerous than ever. You know, Poxy, old pal, sometimes you can be a real bummer. Oh? I wonder if that could have anything to do with my no longer having a body! Boo hoo! I'm a hologram. You know, that crap was sad for the first five years or so, but now it's starting to get on my nerves. I suppose that explains your lackluster productivity of late. I wonder if we'll be able to turn I down the music. I think you're going native. I warn you, Crypto. You have become too invested in your life among these humans. What invested? I'm just running a little business on the side. Now what's wrong with making a little cash? Oh, I am sure Lord and Master Emperor Meningitis, the supreme ruler of the Furon Empire, will understand you setting aside your duty to collect Furon DNA from human brain stems. How about I cut you in for 5%? Done. Back to business! It seems your... Our financial success has made us enemies on the strip. I got a spy going through our files. Murray! You ain't getting crap out of me. Murray, Murray, I have so many ways to get crap out of you, you wouldn't believe it. But this is new shag. Why don't you spill your guts before I do? He's not going to talk willingly, but his thoughts will. First. Okay. He's there. There we go. Turn down the music a little bit. No invert. <laughs> Extreme vibration. Yeah, whatever. Make sure that saved. No, it didn't. Oops. Who betray him? Quickly, read his mind. You don't scare me. Oh, 
Remember that time I tried to remember what it was I couldn't remember? Remember? <laughs> His puny brains are all scrambled. Try scanning him again. Ferret felt the fuzzy ferret. Ferret felt the fuzzy ferret. Ferret felt the fuzzy ferret. Violence it is. Throw him into the walls. Pound the information out of him. Great idea, Pox. What would I do without you? Space freak. What do you think of that, traitor? You think you're tough, space man? How's your brain case, moron? Still in one piece? What a trick. Shaken, Whoa. not stirred. Not even a scratch, space freak! It's going to take a stronger method of persuasion. Use your zapomatic to get this monkey's tongue wagging. Come here, Murray. This'll only sting for a moment. <laughs> Give up yet, monkey? <laughs> Controls don't seem pretty hard. Squeal like a pig. Who hired you? Vinny and Mikey don't Polinari from the really Nero's hard. Palazzo Casino. What are they looking for? Plans, drawings. They think you're opening some kind of alien-themed resort to bring in a family crowd. No one tells me what to do with my joint. Family-oriented casinos? Puh. I hate kids. They're too smart to gamble. Wait! This idea has potential. Gambling for the parents, clowns and jousting knights for the kiddies. It would quadruple our DNA harvest! And our bank accounts. These Molinari sucks are trying to break my rice bowl. Which is 5% my rice bowl. We must end the Molinari brothers' monopoly in Paradiso. Crypto, the time has come to get back out there. And destroy all humans! Golly, thanks for the permission slip, Poxy. The Molinari Brothers' goons are heading our way, Crypto. Defend the space dust! Should I zap them one by one, or just fry them all in a spectacular display of your own revenge? Do whatever you please. I said before, you never were on It's working so far, ain't it? That is... Controls aren't that bad either. Ugh, they're swarming like flies! Give them a lethal swatting with your Zapomatic! Hey, Pops, is there any way I can distract these humans for a moment? Every now and then, I just need to make time. Lucky for you, disco dancing is highly contagious among humans and several. You can reduce a disco fever and watch the monkeys shake their booties. To use disco fever, mental lock a human will hold Y. You did it, Crypto! <laughs> Let's make like a tree and get the hell out of here! I could get around a lot easier if I had my jetpack. What's the hold up? Quality takes time, Crypto. As it happens, I have just completed upgrading your jetpack. Does it make far out sounds like in the cartoons on TV? No, I admitted the silly sounds in favor of performance upgrades. Your new jetpack has more maneuverability and greater thrust than ever before. I like the silly sound.
figured that one. Damn, he's fast. If you went any slower, we'd be traveling backwards in time. Keep your pants on. Oh, wait. You don't have pants. <laughs> you don't have legs. <laughs> Crypto, I have something for you. Fire and forget multi-round heat-seeking anal probes. Ha! Ah, this'll definitely shake some booty. Give your new anal probe a try. You may now target multiple humans, or target each human with multiple probes. That's gotta suck. What's that over there? I don't know, but I want it. It's like a little statue. A little alien statue. Clear with this tap. What was that R button? Palazzo. It's time to take the fight to the Molinaris. All right. Mini map. Hey, Pop. I was thinking we should host a worldwide poker tournament at the Space Dust. However, in order to run a successful casino, we must attract you for all these little weekend gamblers who foolishly bet against the house and loot, not skilled card players who know better. Damn, this is pretty good. Yeah, I mean, uh, but what if we make for a being a 360 show game. out of it? We'll turn professional card players into celebrities. The weekend gamblers will flock to see. It'll be huge, like, like bowling. I see. Well, in this era of overhyped superstars, perhaps it could work. What poker game shall we host? I was thinking something classic, something simple, like uh, No Limit Texas Hold'em. That is absurd. A game like Texas Hold'em would never catch on. Says press Y to speak to him, but you have to wait for him to stop jammering to even do it. If we're ever going to defuse this situation, we need to strike at the heart of the Molineris. So, Pox, I've been waiting for the generic shield tutorial. When are you gonna hit me with some random damage so we can watch my shield bar recharge? Please, Crypto. I've long since abandoned such childish behavior. Well, that's a change. It's not like you to skip any opportunity to smack me around. You're right! There! Hey! Now do you feel better? God, fuck, God, <laughs> What's going on at this god-awful, gaudy monument to Molinari vanity? Sounds like a good time. Well, they dropped his, uh, dialogue. Get past the Molinari security by posing as a human. Oops. I forgot what to do. Oh yeah, it's L button, right? Any human, any human will do. Wait a minute. Oh, okay, you just walk up to him and press Y. 
While body snatched, your victim will lose energy, which, if unchecked, will result in their dead. Bummer. Is there any way I can prevent this horrible, unspeakable fate? You can cortex scan other humans to refill your victim's energy, and of course to read their hidden thoughts, which while mostly random, mundane, or humorous, <laughs> occasionally yield important clues. Hurry up and get into Nero's Palazzo! Yeah, yeah. I'm tired of pinching pennies. I want a goose a hundred dollar bill. <laughs> Let me in, dude. I got an afro. Is this where I might find and utterly destroy the humans known as the Molinari Brothers? I mean, uh, gamble away my kids' college fund. Why, yes, yes it is. Please enter and enjoy the splendor of Nero's Palazzo. I love how this guy sounds like Jack Nicholson. It's 1957 in here. I can see why these Molinaris are worried. Never mind that. Get rid of the gamblers. I got shopkeepers to shake down. A million dollars? Piece of cake. Most days I do more damage than that before breakfast. Oh, destroy the casino. Destroy the Out at the table. Too bad. Bye bye. This place is bumming me out. Live excellent work, creature. The gamblers are being in drill. I think you just shot myself. <laughs> the drinks are spiked. You're crushing my mellow man. Never treated like this at the space dust. Go home, your luck's running cold. Uh, what a bad man. The dealers are cheating. We just jive talking. After I kill you, I'm gonna kill your wife in peace. Hey, I'm just. The excellent. You've driven out the gap. They'll never be turned. How about fun now? Well, I'm off the floor ten seconds and the place comes apart. What the hell happened here? I happen. Hey, I know you. You're that midget from the space dust. Nice Halloween costume. <laughs> You sure you're old enough to I drink? I gave the stuff up, but I like the sound it makes when I pour it on garbage. Well, it'll get got big <laughs> balls, I give you that. But this is my town, and nobody's gonna change it while I'm around. You got that? Then... Okay, space midget. Let's dance. What's that, a ray gun? This is the Orthopox AP-77 Anal Probe. It can cause extreme irritable bowel syndrome, if you feel lucky. Anal Probe? I'm gonna beat you back to Bay City. Ah, forget about it! Ah. You drive away my customers? Humiliate me in my place of business? Insult my brother's hindquarters? Today, the Molinaris declare war on the space dust. Good luck. Odd jobs and challenges. Let's do a let's do a challenge, I guess. Oh no, that's the
Archon. Returning to station. Affirming. Situation no. I don't know why I'm climbing this building, but I just want to see if I can. And you can. Aha, I knew it. the side missions. fell in the pool and it shot me out. Can crypto not fucking swim? I've just intercepted a call from the Molinaries to their outfit back east. It seems they've sent hitters to whack you. Hmm. I see you're learning the lingo. Five percent is five percent. If we let these mafia hoodlums come after us, They'll bring unwanted government attention to our DNA gathering operations. I've discovered that they're having a sit-down outside of Paradiso. Great. Maybe you forgot that my saucer hasn't moved in five years since my little accident. Accident? You were inebriated. Yeah, but I got drunk on accident. Anyway, I'm not running out to the edge of town like Bruce Jenner. I'll blow out a lung. <laughs> no need for that, dear boy. I've got something special. Prepared. Choke doesn't really hold out anymore, does it? Whoa. What is that? Wow. Would you look at this? So that's what you've been doing all those hours, locked in your room alone. Uh, uh, yes! That <laughs> is what I was doing. <laughs> he was tugging on his big Well, hee-haw! You know I'm I mean. so happy I, I'm both a picking and a grinning. <laughs> what she do? I was in such a rush that I'm afraid the saucer is not quite fully operational. Don't tell me the 8-tracks, bro, because I can't ride without my tunes. Worse, actually. Some weapons are missing necessary components. All I want to know is, can I blow things up? Death Ray still comes standard, of course. But until I can boost its power level, you will not be able to bring down large structures. Fine, fine. Give me a half-baked flying saucer. Hell, give me a leaky pinto. Give me a rusty pogo stick. I'm still more than a match for these dime store hoods. That's the spirit. Now, let's get out there and grease those greasers. I like the color of it. Kind of has like a independent tight Day, handling, smooth ride, fine Corinthian leather. Try the lateral and vertical controls. Left, right, backwards, forwards, up, down. That's up. Jeez, you sound like Jack Lo down. Side to side. Destroy as many mobster automobiles as you can before they reach the diner. Gotcha. Let's try this baby out for real. Woo. Man, this thing really moves. 
I've modified your abductor beam as well. You can now abduct scores of humans simultaneously for instant DNA processing. It sucks better than a Hoover. And it works on almost anything. A model plane, a model train, a plastic trim on any car, and people! Crypto, you've raised the alert level! No oh, oh, shit. That's great. You need to use your abducto beam's drain ability to repair the saucer. Your cloaking device should keep these pesky humans from trying to blast you out of the sky. What's a cloak? Okay. Now you see me, now you don't. Obviously doesn't last forever, right? Nothing ever does. I got them all. Ooh, nice limo. That must be one of the bosses. <laughs> Say your even dare, G, Don Goomba. Wait! If we kill him now, we will only bring more unwanted attention. Convince them there's no threat and Paradiso is ours. Use your abducto beam on the Don's vehicle. Take it to a safe location. Got him. Good. Now take him to a remote area. Hey, you can cloak the ship, but you can't really hide this shit. Nice suit. No! No! Time to dawn the dawn. Now body snatch the dawn, Crypto! Quickly! Get to the diner, and remember! You're a jowly Mediterranean racketeer! Orthopox! Orthopox! Is this how you show me respect? I'm rolling the digital visual receptors that simulate what used to be my eyes. This guy moves pretty fast for how big he is. Don Straniero, I regret that I must ask you for the password. Ooh. Password? Is this how you offer respect? I'm sorry, Don Straniero, but it's business. You understand? Out of respect for you, I won't splatter your brains all over the desk. Password? One of the nearby mobsters must know it. Look for a mobster with something on his mind and Cortex scan him. You can't attend the meeting without a dog suit. Get him back. That hurt. Ouch. Ah, spit out. Get him. Here's where you buy the farm, tough guy. Corn beef sandwich. Corn beef sandwich. I gotta restart that shit. Now, body snatch the dawn, Crypto. Quickly, get to the diner and remember you're a jowly Mediterranean racketeer. Arthur Parks. 
Arthur Box, is this how you show me respect? I'm rolling the digital visual receptors that simulate what used to be my eye. That's what I'm Look for a mobster with something on his mind and Cortex scan him. Corn beef sandwich, corn beef sandwich. Corn beef sandwich, corn beef sandwich. Corn beef sandwich, corn beef sandwich. Oh my god. I'll try it one more time, but I'm pretty sure it might be corn beef sandwich. Corn beef sandwich, corn beef sandwich. Don Straniero. Corn beef sandwich. They're waiting for you inside, Don Straniero. We are talking about the end of business as we know it. Paradiso will be dead. Well, I think we're all convinced. We destroy the space dust. Is everyone in agreement? No! Ah! Don Strinero, how nice of you to join our little gathering. Come now, what is troubling you this day? Hmm. It is my belief that Mikey may no longer be of sound mind. We've all got our eccentricities, Don Strinero. How are Mikey's any different? He thinks the owner of the space dust is one of those, it pains me to say it, Omini Verdi Piccoli, extraterrestrial beings. That's a dirty lie. Don Straniero, what's gotten into you? These accusations. Surely you have proof. <laughs> Proof schmoof, what do you think you're talking to? Hey, you grace us with your humor, Don Straniero. Is not the word of your godfather enough? Tell us, what should be the punishment for this crime? This new breakfast cereal. Let Mikey try it. He hates everything. <laughs> hey, you grace us with your humor, Don Straniero. I say that on this day, the five families should turn their backs on the Molinaris and allow Mikey to deal with his little green man from another world on his own time. Listen to him. He's working with the alien. You've wasted our time, Mikey. We are patient men, but not too patient. Don't bother us again with your fairy stories. Damn. You used to be my godfather. You are dead to me now. Jeez, these guys sure take family seriously. Crypto. The Molineries are cut off from the family. Hey, Poxy, uh, didn't you leave something out of this new saucer? I need more firepower. Have no fear, Crypto. Swing by Poxmark to check out my latest destructive creations and bring your DNA. 
Pox Mart is now open. Stand on the saucer and press X. Purchase upgrades weapons. Sapo Matic. How many do I have? Okay. Saucer. Health. Get a lot of weapons. That's the main mission. That's the side mission. No suspect in sight. Continuing patrol. Roger that patrol. Nice work out there, sugar. Designated landing zones. Oh, there must be. Wish you could kind of land it wherever, but whatever. All good, man. something. Hmm. There is an especially important item I need you to locate for me. Hit me. I'll need one of those pet rocks which are so popular with these <laughs> earthlings. 
Let me guess, it's a counterbalance for the graviton emitter. No! They're just so adorable. And since I'm the only one who can make the modifications to the saucer... I guess every hologram should have something to love. <laughs> I've marked the location of a meteorite crash site on your map. Hurry up, Crypto! Get rid of them! Save my pet rock! Freaking weird. Coming through. It's the rapture. I'm doomed. Uh, the, the meteorite is half buried in debris. Use your weapons to blast free the meteorite. Crypto, find a way to push the meteorite to the space dust. Oh my god. The meteorite isn't going to move on its own, Crypto! Maybe if you use psychokinesis to pick up another object, you could push the meteorite. Doing is whacking it around. There's something better I can use. Yeah, I'm trying. This thing's a pain in the ass. Whoa. This thing flies away with the slightest ball. Rollin', 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 keep them doggies rollin'.
my god. Oh, this is such a pain in the ass. So close. What's there? Got it. Holy shit. I hope you're really happy, Pox. I had to smash half a paradiso to bring you that stupid rock. It's not stupid. Collecting rocks is a perfectly acceptable hobby. Yeah, if you're a big dork. What did I get for that? Anything? Thanks for your generous donation to the Save the Furon <laughs> DNA Foundation. If you remember, idols of the great Ark Vuda lie dormant, scattered all over the earth. Yeah, I remember. Placed eons ago to mark landing zones for future invasions. I find them, jump through some hoops for Ark Voodle, and bam, I get a new landing zone for the saucer. It seems like we ought to just be able to land where we want to, but who am yeah, I that's to what argue I said. with the freaking god? Sacred son of Ark Voodle, by the holy book of Pedenda, it pleases me to see thee back in action. Thou knowest the drill, boy. Seek inactive landing zones like this one, festoon with my likeness. Heed my will that the benevolent and most groovy Ark Voodle of the sacred crotch shall activate them for thee. Alright. We'll go. Invade the humans go too far with their mockery of the great Ark Voodle and the sacred crotch. They stuff pennies into my mouth, pull on my sacred Voodle noodle, and berate me when I don't pay out. Remove the pagan slot machine idols from my sight. Thus commands the great Ark Voodle. Crypto, I have just created a new weapon you might find useful. Oh, yes, please. Good stuff, Pox. The Martians are attacking! of the pagan slot machine idols. In return, I grant you a new landing zone to summon your wicked ride. Uh, right on.
Damn. Okay. <laughs> We want to change the culture of Paradiso. We'll have to attack it where it lives. I like it. And what's synonymous with Paradiso? Uh, Elvis? Yes, and? Topless showgirls? I suppose, but? Flamboyant piano players. Smoking! Everyone in Paradiso smokes! I have a plan to drive away the regulars and clear the town for health-conscious me-generation parents eager to frolic away their children's college funds. I like it already. What's the plan? The humans and their infinite paranoia have installed something called the Emergency Broadcast System to alert their subjects of potential danger. Amazingly, it generates a sound so irritating that it causes the humans to get up and turn off their televisions. I didn't think anything could do that. If we can find the dish, we can use it to emit anti-smoking brainwaves. The smokers will flee and this town will be ours for the taking. It's a perfect plan. And so easy on the draw. Collector coming through. Easy. 
gonna kill us all! I think you just shot myself. I think it just shot myself. I'll do that once uh, they get off my ass. <laughs> I love that sound. Wait, that the Paradiso police have installed an emergency broadcast system dish. I feel so much safer. I just had to read that one. Okay. Let's go destroy a dish. Every time one reads the minds of the less enlightened, one is closer to mastering the path of the mind. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, hey, who said that? Said what? Uh, nothing, nothing. I, uh, I must be here. generators appear to be missing. Go down again and tell them you're a technician or some such. Find out where the generators went. You'll be more convincing in human form, of course. You think?
You need to body snatch it. Quit sniffing gas. Oh, this is the end. Slow down, pal. What do you want? I'm here to do maintenance work on the tower. <laughs> and oh, I'm yeah? a cop. You union? I'm a one of a kind specialist. Uh, I, I don't I don't need a union. <laughs> well, the union runs maintenance around here. And they use the generators to power all night poker games at their job sites. Well, I got a job to do, so uh, uh screw the union. You screw them. That there's your kitchen staff, your cleaning crew, your handyman, and your tech specialist. Union men, get it? They got the contract for the whole town. So if you want the generators back, you'd better take it up with them. Because I ain't losing my kneecaps over no antenna. I got kids to think about. You're a real hero. The more one inhabits the body of his enemy, the more one masters the path of the body. Uh, yeah, what you said. I didn't say anything. The news voice in my hearing. for your generous donation to the Save the Furon DNA Foundation. Looking for a landing pad. Running away from brains. Fuck you. If you don't stop wandering aimlessly, I'm going to deactivate myself! Pogs, I'm gonna throw you in the bathtub. Way to go off the beaten path, Crypto! I mean, it's not like we're trying to destroy the world. There are two kinds of Hurons, Pogs. If you went any slower, we'd be traveling backwards in time. Yeah, Can yeah. Can I just have a few seconds of silence? Only you would set out to destroy the world and take the scenic route. Enough, Pogs. I didn't know you were such a sucker for quiet romantic oh. excursions. What are you, a nagging housewife? Excellent! Return it here and I will begin to upload our signal. The more one uses psychokinetic power successfully, the closer one is to mastering the path of space. There's the voice again! What the hell's going on here? Crypto, what are you talking about? I don't know. I keep hearing this strange voice. That will do. Bring the generator back here. Oh, how 
wait. There is a major fossil fuel crisis, and this emergency broadcast array runs on gas-powered generators. Typical humans. Crypto, give the generators a good jolt with your zappo -matic. That should get them humming. Quickly, power up the generators with your zappo -matic. There, did we do it? I think it worked. Uh oh. Well, that's done it. But now we've alerted them to our presence. Crypto, you'll need to keep them at bay until I complete the procedure. Oh, God. Ah. Hmm. I Okay, Dr. Fox, get the word out about the dangers of smoking. I'll try to hold them off. Just don't take them. Attention, citizens of Paradiso. This is a vital public safety announcement. Smoking is hazardous to your health. Fox, they've known that for years. It still hasn't stopped them from lighting up. Ah. Yes, well, let's try this one. Smoking introduces carbon monoxide and deadly carcinogens to the body. Carcinogens? You make that up? No, 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 it's very real. Benzene, nitrosamines, formaldehyde, and hydrogen cyanide. Chemical mumbo jumbo. You're blinding them with science, Pax. Smoking accelerates the natural aging process and ensures your life by as much as 30 years! Medic! Medic! Oh, come on, Poxy. These monkeys can't even think that far yeah, ahead. My position. Sound like gray skin's a bad thing. This is flight leader. We are inbound and approaching the target now. <laughs> well, there is one last part. Smoke is to cause reduced blood flow to the Space midget written all over it. You know those things are gonna kill you. randomly dying. Thank you. 
and fair. Uh, come again. The famous husband and wife variety act are in town as we speak. They're playing at Nero's Palazzo and it's sold out. Oversold, in fact. Yeah, cause half the ticket holders would be too drunk to show up anyway. <laughs> God, I love this town. <laughs> so, how did the hottest act in town end up at the Molinari's place? The Molinaries hired the couple to draw new customers to replace the ones you drove away from their casino. But if the show were cancelled... They'd all want a refund, and the Molinaries would take it right in the assets! And how would you suggest I go about breaking up their little show? Fry them on stage? Nothing quite so drastic, my hypo-violent moon. No. I have a more entertaining idea. Yeah. I say we take two corn muffins, a live badger, a teaspoon of flesh-eating bacteria, and... Uh, uh, I suppose you just want me to talk to them. Hmm. The word around town is that Fair has been making goo-goo eyes at a certain southern rock and roll personality by the name of Leg Tallman. Perhaps a touch of marital trouble. So, what do you say, Crypto? Ready for a little marriage counseling? All right, Pox. I'll go snatch the singing hick and bust up the lovebirds. Good! Let's make their breakup one for the record books! Yeah, just let me slip into something a little more comfortable. Southern comfortable. Find Fair's not-so-secret boyfriend, Leg Tolman, and Sammy and Fair's marriage and TV show will be finished. These heathen monsters who attempt to whack my sacred son have in so doing incurred the wrath of the mighty Akul himself. I decree their punishment shall be a thorough anal probing. Do this for me and I shall drop the new landing zone for your brand spanking new ride. That's a lot. Oof.
hope I get Leg Talman to sign my left boob before he leaves the Sultan or passes out. Sinatra can really rock for an old guy. like chicken. How do we know that chicken doesn't taste like kangaroo? Train collector coming through. There he is. Now, make those fabulous blonde locks your own. Ah. Snatch him. I am in love with an Armenian engine, and I ain't ashamed to think it. Ow! Ow! Hey, I think I'm drunk. Yes, yes, physical sensations don't rub it in. Sleep it off later, just get to the Sammy and Fair show! Looky, Hershey. You try and start fight, funny guy. Mm. Hurry, Crypto. You need to get Lake Tom and Daniel's Palazzo before the show starts. Must be one of Jerry's kids. I think I'm too late. It's about to free your mind of distractions, Crypto. That voice. It's. it's in my head. What voice? Concentrate on expanding your mind. That voice! Are you really hearing voices, or are you angling for a Section 8 like that cross-dressing fellow on MASH? You know, Klinger, who in the later episodes wasn't in drag anymore because Radar left? Meditate with me, Crypto. Meditate? If it means doing this, <laughs> hell yeah. Time to stop is a powerful book. It's time. Huh. Crypto, why are you wasting time? The show is moments away from starting. Hey, man, I heard that hot babe fair is performing tonight. Yeah, she sure is, but Sammy warned me to keep you out, sir. No way, dude. Why you gotta be so down on a rambling man? Because the last time I let somebody suspicious in, the whole casino got wrecked. Listen, man, I'm just Cupid's errand boy here. I gotta see fair. It's about love. All right, fine, go in. But when you get thrown out head first, don't come crying to me. All right. There they are. Send them into counseling. That's obviously Cher. Right? We've got each other, hun. Thank you. Yep. All right, Jehoshaphat. <laughs> uh, that's entertainment. Yeehaw! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the original Midnight Rider, Leg Tallman. Come on up, Leg. I'd like to give him a leg up. Woo! <laughs> hey, Leg. We're always up for a little showbiz repartee, but what are you trying to do? Break up my act? <laughs> Hit the road, Bearskin. Fair's riding with me now. I got you, babe. Woohoo! <laughs> I got you, babe. I got you. Hey, yeah. man, it's a family show. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
No, sir. It's just my boyish southern charm. I can't help it. Well, that's a relief. For a second, I thought you were trying to steal my girl. Listen, schnoz, I want to steal your girl. I won't have to try. Know what I mean? Well, that's just rude, man. Gypsies, tramps, and thieves couldn't keep me away. He was born a rambling man. Woo! Well, that'd be just my kind of luck. <laughs> I always did have a hard time with women. What are you talking about? You got too many women. I'm gonna take one off your hands. Oh, leg, take me away. You know, not a lot of guys who look like me could get a fabulous diva like Fair. I say, I mean, a goddess hanging out with a big nose twerp like you, she should get the best actress award. That's it, man. I'm going into politics. Because I'm a solo act. <laughs> Relax, babe. The beat goes on. You know, if it weren't for us, I bet they would have gone on forever. Crypto, meet me at the Space Dust. I have made an important discovery. What's this important discovery, Pox? You, uh, you invent a record player that won't skip or something? No, Crypto. I believe I finally made some sense out of this path of enlightenment you keep carrying on about. As much as one can from a scientific perspective, anyway. Enlighten me. <laughs> the paths of enlightenment this voice in your head refers to appear to be directly linked to your proficiency with core mental abilities. Break it down for me like I'm a caveman. Very well. The more you use your body snatch successfully, the more you advance in the path of the body. The path of the mind refers to your power over the minds Keep of your skipping enemies. On the last the more you use your cortex scan, for example, the more you advance in the path of the mind. And the more I use PK, the more I advance in the path of space, right? Yes, and the path of time appears to be linked to this new ability of yours to stop time or whatever. Although I haven't figured out quite how yet. So what does all that get me? Once you've successfully performed these abilities to a degree this mysterious voice in your head deems satisfactory, he tells you to meditate with him. I get it. That's when I use the meditation chamber. So, so I'm not crazy. Perhaps now would be a good time to try meditating in order to improve your mental powers. I'm curious to see what happens. Me too. If I don't come out of that chamber with the ability to toss cars around, I'm taking a sledgehammer to it. <laughs>
Sammy and Fair Splitsville, and those smokers should be halfway to the Midwest by now. What I wouldn't do for a nice long drag on a refreshing menthol. The dry paper touching my lips, the particles curling through my central gas exchange membranes. What? You never smoked. Oh, the sweet, sweet pleasures of the flesh. Alas, alack. What's the new plan, Stan? When are we gonna stick it to the Molinaris for good? Immediately! I determine locations of the Molinaris' local business interests. Destroy the buildings and we destroy the Molinaris! Good. A d we'll use the saucer to annihilate every last business run by the Molinaris. Get to the saucer! All right, guys, I am going to call it quits for today. So this will be part one. I'll be back for part two later on. Um, until then, take it easy, guys.